Hi everyone, this is Peter. Today I want to introduce is how you do your 4K update onto your X70. Okay, so because um, the, uh, the step is a little bit, little bit complicated, so let us talk about how to do it. So today we need several things. A fully charged batteries, a X70. Make sure, okay, make sure your X70 is already upgraded into the version 2.0. So I will show you how to do it. And then, for sure, is the 4K upgrade cook. So when you open it, this package, you will find out there is two papers. So one paper will be showing you how to do the 4K upgrade. And the other thing in the other one is the most important one, is the purchasing cook. It's the purchasing cook. So then, at the end, you need the computer. So how to do it, okay, is first, you have to go to this website and then to do uh, user registrations. So if you are not already registered, so you have to register it first. So once you do that and then, okay, so you go into, the, um, into your account, into your account on the, left, on the left top, okay, there will be a column and then it's showing you the key register or key installations. So once you click in, and then you will see two columns. First columns will be, uh, will be let you choose, okay, maybe probably that will be a code on the, uh, on the register key update, which is the CBKZX70FX, or maybe the X, uh, XD cam, something else. On that, and the other columns, that will be uh, probably a code so that will be, okay, they, this update will be X70. So you click X70. Then you click search. So when you click search, you will suddenly find out, okay, maybe in the off, uh, uh, under the, um, the window, it will pop up some information, which is uh, the, uh, uh, maybe the 40 update on the uh, X70. So, okay, so you click it in. So it will, you will jump into another window. So in another window, you will show there is two columns first, is the purchasing key. The purchase key is probably the firm, uh, the 4K update uh, key, which is actually I show you before, and then it's highlighted. So you have to put it that key into, uh, into that columns. And the other thing is the unique device ID. So what is a unique device ID? Is on every, on every X70, once you update your firmware into 2.0, in your menu, you can go to the menu and then you can finally search. There will be a device ID on each X70. So make sure that you have to upgrade your firmware into 2.0. Once you see that, you have to type in your device ID onto, uh, onto the unique device ID columns. Make sure that you have to make sure that the numbers, the informations have to type in correctly. If you put it, the information incorrectly, so they will still give you uh, the information to let you know, okay, it's registered, and then maybe at the same, you can actually put that files that they give you into your X70, but that will not allow you to update. So if you really face in these situations, please, with, please contact your reseller, which buy the firmware upkeep kit or Sony. So, okay, so we assume everything is actually perfectly, everything is correct. So we press next. So then you will pop up another window and then tell you that, oh, congratulations, you already registered. So later you will receive two emails. So first emails will be, uh, will be emails that like tell you that, okay, the registration is completed and then there will be a PDF file. That PDF file will be, um, Additional 4K features on the uh, X70 is a menu. On the other email, it will give you a folder. So you have to make sure that your folder has to drag into an SD card, then you put it into your X70, and then in the X70, you go to the menu, you go to option, you go to option update. So make sure that, okay, this function is only happens when you are actually register, uh, update your firmware into 2.0. So you press OK. When everything is doing OK, and then OK, so the whole 4K update is completed. Make sure that when you do this, 
your X70 have to connect it with your AC power or maybe your battery have to be almost full power or at least 70%. Otherwise, it may be call you, it may maybe ask you to stop the registration too. So make sure that it is also maybe uh, do that before maybe uh, you do the update. So that is it. The 4K update is already complete. Um, it's very easy, although it's a little bit like few steps you have to follow, but if you are follow all the steps correctly, and then it's actually pretty straightforward. So if you want to uh, know more about like maybe this 4K uh, update, uh, you can visit ANS or Sony. For the X70 firmware upgrade 2.0, it's pretty straightforward. So what you need is USB cable, X70, and also your computer. So first, okay, make sure that your computer have to close it, have to disable the sleeping mode, because in between this uh, firmware upgrade, it will take maybe almost around 15 minutes. So if you, if your computer is go into sleep mode and then interrupt the firmware update, it might be possible you have to bring your, your camera back to Sony for repair. So make sure that your sleeping mode is disabled, okay? So please go to pro.sony-asia.com and then go to product, camcorder, XD cam, X70. So when you go to the X70 page and then go to resources, so in the resources, and then you will see, oh, there is a firmware upgrade there. If you are PC, you choose .exe files. And then if you are Mac like me, and then you go to choose the .dmg files. So they will start to download the files. So once you download the files, okay, so you will see, you open it, you will find out there is a, a, a software called the firmware updater. So you click, double click firmware updater, and then you will see a, a window like this. So, follow the step. First, connect your USB cables with your X70. Open your, uh, switch on your, your X70, and then connect your USB into your computer. So, follow this step, and then press next. And then they will, they will check your X70 is which versions. If you are not 2.0, so update it. So go to next, go to next, go to next. And then the process and then the procedure, the firmware upgrade will be do it for you. Make sure that both X70 and also your computer is actually charged fully power or maybe connected with your AC power. So after a while, 15 minutes, and then all the registry uh, update is finished. So you can actually go to your menu go to uh, the, uh, the down on the submenu and then find the versions. Make sure that your version is already updated to 2.0. That's it, pretty straightforward.